Tag management gives you an incredible advantage in your marketing and I don't think that enough people are taking advantage of it. So I wanna talk a little bit about how to use it and how it works, but more importantly, I wanna start off with the benefits of why it's important. And I'm gonna run you down this list really quickly. So number one, it's gonna improve your website speed because tag management, what it does is it takes all of the codes, the tracking codes that are in your header tag, and it combines them into one little JavaScript file that I'm gonna show you in a second, and it speeds up the load time of your pages. It's very easy to use, specifically Google Tag Manager. If you're using Telium or Adobe, it's a little bit more advanced, but Google Tag Manager, honestly, I prefer it. And it's very, very easy to use, and it reduces the need for a developer. And everything that I'm gonna show you in this GTM mini video series here is how to install it without a developer. So you don't need a developer for any of this, which is gonna save you time and money, and it's gonna allow you to make agile decisions. And one of the things that I use it for a lot is Facebook ads. You know, if I wanna do some custom audiences, some custom conversions, if I wanna track a purchase, or if I wanna track a form submission, I can do it myself like that without a developer, whereas previously, you know, I'd have to send them a code and I would have to instruct them where to go, and where it would fire. I'm gonna show you how that works in just one second to save you a ton of time. And of course, it allows you to do advanced tracking, stuff that just traditional analytics does not allow you to do. So let's talk quickly about how it works. So if you right click on any page in your website and go to view source, you'll see the HTML, CSS, the JavaScript, all the code that's making that page look what it looks like. In the header tag, if you have analytics on there, you'll see a JavaScript pixel for analytics. You'll see uh, if you're tracking AdWords conversions, AdWords, uh, floodlight tags, if you're doing some display stuff, um, and uh, double click. Facebook, if you have a Facebook pixel on there, if you want to track conversions, if you just want to remarket on Facebook, you need a tracking code. Uh, email marketing, if you have an Infusionsoft or an active campaign, you need something on your website that will talk back to the email platform to trigger email sequences. So all these things, this is just an example. You could have way more too, depending, Quantcast, Comscore, all these different tracking tags. These are very heavy pieces of JavaScript file. And what this does is these all have to load when your page loads in order for them to fire and communicate to that platform. So what Tag Manager does and why Google is so smart, you know, Tag Management's been around for a while, but what Tag Manager does is it takes each one of these individual tracking codes and you create a tag within a container. So a container is simply one piece of JavaScript that goes right in the opening body of your website that can track all of these things. So you can get actually get rid of all of these things on your site, migrate them to Tag Manager, and they'll all be tracked with this one little piece of JavaScript that you put on your site. And the way that it works is for each one of these things that you wanna track, you create a tag within that container. And it's very, very easy to do once you see how easy Google Tag Manager is, the beautiful interface. It's literally click, paste, save, and done. You can track analytics as a tag, you can track Facebook, you can track advanced custom events, goals, you can track button clicks. There's so many things that you can track within here that are very easy to do. And again, in this mini video mini series, I'm going to show you how to do all of it without a developer. It's very, very powerful and it saves you a ton of time. It saves you a ton of money and allows you to get better data and speed up your website at the same time. And again, Agile decisions are key because again, as opposed to saying, hey, you know, we want to get some AdWords uh, remarketing pixels on, on a client's website, you got to develop the pay, you got to get the actual code, you've got to send it to the developer, you got to tell them where to fire it. Within Tag Manager, all you do is you create a new tag, you paste this piece of JavaScript in here, and then you set rules for where you want it to fire. So for example, Google Analytics, you'd want to fire it on all pages because you want to track all pages. For AdWords conversions, you want to track it on your thank you page, you want to track it, track it on your checkout page, um, all these things. So you just set these rules and you just tell it with a click of a button, hey, I only want this tag to fire on a checkout page. I only want the Facebook pixel to fire on the thank you page. So again, as opposed to going in here and digging into your cPanel and your code to put your Facebook pixel on all of your thank you pages, you simply do it in Tag Manager with a click of a button and it does it for you. Click publish and the tag is on your website and it's all communicated through here. So. Again, I wanted this to be an intro to the benefits of why and how you should be using Tag Manager. I have this great video mini series. It's all free. It's on my YouTube channel and my Facebook page. It's going to show you how to put the 
this in your C panel very easily without a developer. It's gonna show you how to put analytics, Facebook, AdWords, all of these different tags and how to set up the firing rules very easily to get you on your way to being a tag management expert within less than an hour. So make sure you stay tuned for those videos. Again, they're gonna be on my YouTube channel and my Facebook page. Make sure you like and subscribe to get them and I will see you guys in the next videos.